hello guys welcome back in today's video i'll be showing you ways i dress simple but still try to keep it bold and modest If you're new here, hi, my name is Glory. You are so welcome to my channel. If you're not new, thank you so much for returning. And if you have if you have not subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for. Please make sure to hit on that subscribe button. Also, click on the like button of this video if at the end you've enjoyed watching this video. And don't forget to turn on your notification bell so you always be notified each time I upload a new video here on my channel. One of the ways. I dress simple but still try keeping it bold and modest is by combining one color of outfit together. I know it sounds so boring, but trust me, it's not. <laughs> it's not boring at all. If you follow my YouTube shorts, because I do a lot of styling on my YouTube shorts, or if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen me styling this beige on beige. Yes. So I've got a dark beige trouser here. This is a high-waisted wide leg trouser that fits me and covers me properly, okay? And I've got a light beige sweatshirt here. So I will insert the clip either side of the screen of me styling this beige on beige, okay? I will insert the screen. I don't know which side, this side or that side, but you, you will surely see it on the screen. So I tend to combine this with either beige trainers or beige flats depending on the trouser i'm wearing but if i'm wearing my wide leg i wear a trouser due to the length i wear it with my chunky beige trainers this whole outfit are, of, are all from h&m okay the light beige wide leg trouser the, the sorry the dark beige wide leg trouser is from h&m the light beige sweatshirt is from h&m as well and depending on the weather if it's chilly outside because we are currently in spring here in uk i tend to throw on um, a trench coat and the trench coat is from h&m love love the trench coat the quality of that trench coat is top notch let me honestly let me show you the trench coat you'll still see it on the screen but let me still show you so this is the trench coat here again i'll put it on the screen it is amazing good quality it's like your you know the way you have like a raincoat material that like waterproof is it waterproof yeah waterproof sort of material amazing and it, you can easily throw it in the wash and it just washes off so well and gets dry quickly so love love this trench coat so yeah you can do this sort of outfit with any color it's called monochromatic look so me styling it with beige on beige does not mean I can do any other color. I can, I can do it with black if I want to. I can do it with white. I can do it with green. I'll be showing you the green one in a minute. But any color, just one color, but it differentiates of that color. Put it together. As boring as it sounds, trust me, it's a beautiful look. It looks so stylish, chic, and I love the way it pulls up bold on me and the way I make sure the clothes fits well in order to, you know, look modest on me okay next outfit is this green on green outfit again monochromatic look one color but at the same time is pulling up bold and trying to keep in keep i try keeping it modest but making sure that the clothes is not you know too reveal it's not revealing or tight making sure it fits properly but that it looks more modest on me okay so this is what it looks like. I'm going to be going back, moving back so you can see it properly. But yes, I have here your the zip sweatshirt. This sweatshirt is from H&M. Be a crop sweatshirt, but obviously I size that. I tend to size up. If I want a crop style in a blouse or sweatshirt or t-shirt, I size up because I don't obviously, due to my sort of style, being modest, I try to make sure that I'm not revealing my body in any sort of way. Making sure that I'm keeping my outfit, my look modest as much as possible. So yes, so I sized up to the biggest size they have. So, but yeah, it's, a, it's a meant to be a crop uh, sweatshirt, just like the light beige one I just showed you in a 
showed you a few minutes ago but yeah this is the green one beautiful comfortable as well this color love love color so if you're someone that you are not into maybe wearing neutrals such as like a plain because sort of you're like your white your beige you know those light colors if you are or you have people that just love neutrals neutrals and they don't like color but you're someone that you love color but at the same time you like incorporating uh neutrals into your outfit this is a good way to do it you can do green on green you know you're not having so much prints or anything you just have one color but at the same time you're looking good you're looking bold you're looking chic you're looking stylish style out these and this khaki green chunky trainer trainers is from H. <laughs> outfit is as you can see i'm wearing a button down shirt white shirt and ways i can just tweak things simple things just simple simple steps just to make it fit the way i want it to fit it's just by rolling up the sleeves again if you follow my youtube show you would have seen me you know so roll up the sleeves of my blazer the sleeves of my button down shirt such as such like this um like this one with my hairband i use hairband for everything hairband your hairband can do a lot for you okay so for example this button down shirt is way long it's way long even when i still button it at the hand it's still long i still want it to look more fitted not in like tight tight to tighten it no a look when you roll up the sleeves of your long sleeve gives you gives you it takes it up the notch it gives you it takes it to another level i'll be using my hairband here hairband all you need is hairband so if you're like me you do braids or you just the lady you've got hairband you can just get a hairband from the shop all you need is hairband i'll be rolling up this roll up, rolling up the sleeves of this button down shirt okay hello band to roll up the sleeves of the shirt and it's not falling down because you've got that hairband securing it holding it so it doesn't fall down but at the same time it's nice like this i can still wear it like this something different okay so what i do again is i take a hairband another hairband so i'll take this hairband and i'll be tying the back of this shirt Again, if you follow my YouTube shot, you would have seen it. Okay, it's not new, but I use hairband for everything. Like I said, a hairband, it's a lifesaver for me when it comes to my my making my clothes fit the way I want them to fit or the way I want them to look. Okay? I have to turn face the wall so you can see what I'm doing from the back. So that's my hairband. Before like this. And just tie it around the shirt like this. Tie a bit more, just to secure it a bit more. Something like this happening, okay? Something like this. Hopefully, you can see it from there. Tuck it in to the shirt like this. Okay. Hopefully, you can see the hairband, but. Something like this, okay. You have. Can you see the way it's just by using hairband has just transformed this white bottom down shirt. This is mentioned by the way, okay. I wear my husband's one a lot, but I bought this one. This is from Nest and uh, from the men's section, and because my husband's one is 16 and a half, but because I love oversized clothes, so I went for 18 regular. The same, this is your regular fit uh, white shirt. This white shirt is so easy to maintain. Don't worry, don't even worry about the iron it because it's so easy to iron, easy to care for. Yeah, it's not, it, it doesn't give you a headache when you know sometimes it's like you don't want to wear button down, especially the white one because of the material you have to iron and all that. This doesn't do that. This is such a and they call it easy, they're easy care 
white shirt so easy to maintain but yes totally different look just by using hair band guys hair band this is just a simple ways i dress but still looking bold and you see keeping it modest at the same time okay still keeping it modest and the bright orange wide leg jeans is from new look this is a jeans it's from new look um it's a high waist there i think this is the adelaide adelaide wide leg jeans like i mentioned i love wide leg jeans it's not like i don't wear it's not like i don't wear other jeans i wear skinny jeans but wide leg high waisted jeans my favorite because they fit my shape because i'm quite curvy you know so they fit me properly so yeah this is just ways you can tweak things and simple things will just be elevated just like that just like that okay so for shoes i'll be pairing this outfit with my white high top converse all stars converse i've had this converse geez since 2018 2018 i've had this converse i got it from shun shun is a brand they carry different sort of different sort of shoes they have any sort of shoe any sort of brand you're looking for definitely check out shoe they have it there so i got it this high top, white high top converse is the this is in the uh, the leather material just find it easy like even when it's raining you can still wear it out they have the like the cloth one but i prefer this leather material one because you just can wear it in any weather to be honest but yeah and any in all season so I'll be starting up with this white high top canvas from Shoe. Okay, it's all stars, but I got it from Shoe. <laughs> trouser like a plain trouser plain shirt clean blazer which is what i'm going to be doing with this look so i've got this lovely green bold green dress print of course it's from h and it's like this year shirt dress and i have it in mid midi midi length almost maxi but it's not as you go back so you can see but yeah like a midi length love love this lens from h m beautiful bold print in green lovely but i want to still like tone it down a little bit but at the same time the plain clothes i'll be using to tone it down i still want to uplift that plain clothes hope i'm making sense so you kind of like they're kind of complementing each other let me show you what i mean hold on don't go anywhere just hold it for a sec <laughs> so we have this plain light beige blazer from h m this is h m but yeah this is a beige uh, blazer from h m beautiful color but it's simple yes i want to elevate it and this one is bold it's like yes i'm here and i'm here to stay but i want to tone it down like just chill for a minute okay chill for a minute so they both complementing each other okay so it's about adding bold prints to a simple clothes simple outfit that's what i'm doing and that's the ways i dress simple but still keeping it bold keeping it modest making sure that the length is good that the size fits it's not tight it's not you know clean in anywhere but still fit okay so i've put on my lovely beige blazer on top of my lovely bold print dress see how it looks looks nice and oversized but obviously we're going to be getting it to fit and getting it to 
stay the way we want it to stay, okay? We can still rock it like this. I will anyway. Trust me, I will, because that's what I love. <laughs> but sometimes you just want to like, mm, we just want you to stay here, okay? We just want you to stay up, okay? So again, what do I do? I grab my hairband. Hairbands, not oh, band, bands, because they are plural, they are two, okay? And just put it on the sleeve of the blazer. Pull it up, pull it up, pull it up. Okay, so we want something looking like this. Okay, stay up. But at the same time, we still want to be seeing that bold print underneath coming through. Okay, I'll do the same for this hand. And pull it up. True. Okay, it doesn't have to be equal, just as long as it's up. You know, it's fine. So I've got belts on the dress. I've got like this beige slim belt. Again, HM is so handy because this dress is oversized, but the days I want it to like, you know, be more. Fitted without being much, just put belt around it. So that's what I've done. Okay, the blades are leaving as it is, but the hand staying up, and we're still seeing the bold print dress coming through from the front, the side. And yes, we're looking it's simple, sounds simple, but it looks bold. And the fit looks modest, okay? So these are just the ways I dress simple but still keeping it bold. Again, modest, all right? So let me get a shoe. Is it a shoe? So let me get shoes to complete the look. Shoes, yeah, shoes to complete the look. Shoes. <laughs> so for shoes, we're going to be wearing this kind of a wedgie. I do not wear heels, heels like that. I'm sure if you've been following my style video, you know by now I've mentioned it several times. Even if you haven't heard me mention it from my <laughs> style video, you would have seen that I wear a lot of flats and a lot of sneakers, trainers, yeah. And if I do wear heels, it's going to be like this, this. And it has to be in a, a wedge, wedge, is it? Like no, block heels, yes, block heel form. Nothing six inch, no, no, it has to become in block heel form if I'm wearing heels, okay. But yes, I'll be wearing this. Um, I think this is these are called espad espadrilles, espadrilles. Correct me if I'm wrong, I'll put it on the screen. But espadrilles shoes, yeah, I think because of this thing it has at the bottom and it comes like with a lace. So I'll style it with this outfit right here, all right, just in case if I didn't mention the shoes. The espadrilles shoes are from Matterland and they're like in a light beige color, okay? They're from Matterland, so affordable. <music> Let me say that again balancing top to bottom what you're wearing on the top and what you're wearing on the bottom so for example this outfit let me move back so you can see me properly this outfit got skinny jeans on and it's not ideal yes having skinny jeans on then put on a fitted tight shirt on so, in order to balance the skinny jeans, 
well properly because you put on something oversized like this it doesn't mean it has to it doesn't have to be as big as mine but something at least more roomy a little bit roomy on the top because you've got tight happening you've got skinny tight happening at the bottom okay so that's what we call balance top to bottom okay say vice versa you can balance bottom to top so if you're wearing baggy trouser you can balance it say you know fitted not too roomy top okay but me to be honest i break all the rules sometimes i do it <laughs> sometimes i do it I, I wear baggy trousers and i wear baggy top or baggy bottom and baggy top yeah but to look more bold and modest and stylish chic at the same time you know it's still simple things simple dressing just if you're wearing skinny jeans just wear something roomy a little bit roomy at the top just to balance it out okay skinny jeans from Joni jeans from Topshop okay got, got it from Topshop a few years back very stretchy so if you're like me curvy and you're being struggling to get good jeans that fit you definitely check out this brand Joni it has a lot of stretch a lot of stretch in it these jeans and for shirts again i'm wearing button down just kind of just striped um bottom down shirt again this is men's got this from amazon this is in size extra extra large because i want it big i want it big go big or go home okay <laughs> with me you either go big or you go home get it if you don't get it forget about it this girl that I watch, what's her name? Rejoice Creed. She's a Nigerian blogger. She stays in Ibadan. Lovely girl. She always says this. If you don't get it, forget about it. Okay. But yes, this is it. But we're, this, you know what we're going to do, right? You know what time it is. It's time to roll up the sleeves. We're rolling up the sleeves of this shirt. Again, we're using our good, handy hairbands. Let me get it. Yeah, our lovely good handy hairbands is going to be doing the work for us again. So running up the sleeve. <laughs> Sometimes they are coat. Yeah. Don't be sleeping on men's clothes and their blazers. Ta ask my husband, he'll tell you. His blazers, his bottom down shirt does not belong to him alone. It belongs to both of us. Yeah. Both of us are wearing the blazers, the bottom down shirts. And he's like, keep my clothes. I'm like, look. They're here, so I'm going to style them. They're so comfortable. So, do not be sleeping on men's clothes. Again, especially their button-down shirts, the blazers, the sweatshirts, the hoodies. Yeah, but the button-down shirt is the key. The key and the blazers. Mm. <laughs> All rolled up, looking nice and, you know, staying where we want it to stay. So, this is what we call balancing top to bottom so again looks simple but at the same time it is bold it is modest you can see keeping it with nice roomy shirt dancing break this is our break dance so if you're there rock with me dance Please don't take me serious. I am such a character, honestly. Oh, my days. Okay, so for the shoes, I'll be styling this outfit with this beige flat pointy toe shoes from H&M. <laughs> Wow. 
Well, well, well. It is time to say see you soon. It is time to say goodbye, but see you soon. See you in my next video. But before you go, okay, before you go, I just, I just want to know, what do you think? What do you think? Tell me what you think about the looks. Tell me the ways you dress simple but still keeping it bold. Tell me in the comments. I would like to know. I would like to know. <laughs> also, make sure to hit the like button of this video if you have enjoyed it, of course. Subscribe if you have not subscribed. Turn on the notification bell, guys. Please turn on the notification bell because if not, when a new video like this drop on my channel, you have no clue what's happening right here. So turn on the notification bell so you get some clues. You get notified each time a new video drops here. And also follow me on Instagram. On, I'm on Instagram. Feel free, to, feel free to follow me on there as well. And until next time, adios. Bye. Bye.